If this is your first time using your GoDirect SpectraViz Plus, I'm excited for you to get started. During this video, I'll be sharing with you three simple steps to get started with your spectrometer. I'll start by unboxing my new device. In this box, you'll find your GoDirect SpectraViz Plus, along with a mini USB cable, a power supply, and 15 plastic cuvettes with lids. If you're using a Chromebook, computer, or mobile device, you'll need to have our spectral analysis app installed on your device before you use your new spectrometer. You can visit the link below to access the installer that's right for your device. If you're using a LabQuest 3 with your spectrometer, the LabQuest app already has support installed. Once your spectral analysis app is launched on your device, you can connect your spectrometer in one of two ways. The first option is to connect your spectrometer with the included USB cable to a computer or Chromebook. You won't need to charge your spectrometer in advance or connect the power supply. The second option is to connect your spectrometer via Bluetooth wireless technology. To do this, you'll need to charge your spectrometer at least eight hours with the included power supply. I've charged this one in advance. I've made sure to disconnect the power supply before I collect data, as it is recommended that you do not have the power supply attached while collecting data wirelessly. I turn on my spectrometer by pressing the power button once. The Bluetooth LED will blink. If you're using this spectrometer with spectral analysis, click or tap connect a spectrometer. Select your GoDirect SpectraViz Plus from the list of discovered wireless devices by matching the serial number on the label with the one from the list. Click or tap Done to enter data collection mode. Now you're ready to select your experiment. Select a spectrometer mode from the list of options. With GoDirect SpectraViz Plus, your options are absorbance, percent transmittance, fluorescence, emissions, and advanced full spectrum. Once you've selected the type of spectrometer mode, you need to select the type of experiment from the drop-down menu. Today, I wanna do absorbance versus wavelength, but I could also do Beer's Law or an akinetics experiment by clicking on the appropriate option. And now you're ready to do your experiment. Spectral analysis will walk your students through any necessary preparation steps, including calibration or wavelength selection, depending on the experiment selected. For more information to help you get started, see the link below for sample experiment downloads and instructional screencasts. And you can always reach out to our tech support team at support at vernier.com.